So Eugene, I don't know if you remember this, but one of the first things you said to me when we first started hanging out was, a person is the average of their five closest friends. So for Eugene, the people around him, his friends, his family, his loved ones, they form a core part of his identity, how he views himself. And Mabel, once you came into his life, I knew for a fact that quote was true because, you know, Eugene was great beforehand. But after he met you, his average went way up. When you have two friends like Mabel and Eugene, two friends who have always been there for you without fail, two friends who by their very example show you the type of person that you should be, and those friends ask you to speak at their wedding to celebrate the love that they share between each other. I just can't imagine anywhere else I would rather be than right here and right now for them. Dear Mabel, I stand here today with our friends and family, knowing how lucky I am to have you as my wife. In the years that we've been together, you have taught me so much. You have taught me to be more emotionally present, to be more engaging with people, and to look past the veneers of superficiality and look at what's important. With our relationship, you have emboldened me to fight for our love to expect nothing less, and to be there for each other. Thank you for letting me be in your heart. Thank you for making an effort to be my comforter, my safe haven, embrace my wanderlust in me, and be my forever travel adventure partner. Changi, I love you and I vow to grow with you. Now, I've never understood marriage. When I see most married couples, I see boredom. I see confinement. I feel the fear of being trapped. But that's not what happens when I look at Mabel and Eugene. When I look at them, I don't see the dull gray blandness of routine. I see the bright light of companionship. I don't sense anger at confinement. I see the beauty of marriage. When I look at Mabel and Eugene, all I can feel is the strength of their love. to recognize you, appreciate you, and protect your heart, and stand up for you, and stand by your side. Therefore, I give you my hand, I give you my love, I give you myself, the good, bad, and yet to come.